Are you having trouble with FaceTime and iMessage notifications not showing up on your iPhone? Missing those alerts can be super annoying, especially if you're expecting important calls or messages. But don't worry, I've got you covered. In this guide, I'll walk you through a few solutions that'll help ensure those notifications pop up just as they should. Let's dive right in and fix this together. Solution 1. Check notification settings for FaceTime and iMessage. First, open the settings app on your iPhone. Then scroll down and tap on notifications. After that, scroll down until you find FaceTime and tap on it. Next, make sure allow notifications is turned on. Choose your alert style and ensure sounds is enabled. Now repeat these steps for messages. Scroll down and tap messages. Confirm that allow notifications is turned on, then set your preferred alert settings. Solution 2. Toggle iMessage and FaceTime. Sometimes, simply turning iMessage and FaceTime off and back on can resolve the issue. Open settings, scroll down and tap on messages, toggle iMessage on. If it's already on, turn it off, wait a moment then turn it back on. Now go back, find FaceTime and tap on it, toggle FaceTime on. Similarly, if it's already on, turn it off and back on again. Solution 3. Enable background app refresh. Allowing FaceTime and iMessage to refresh in the background helps keep notifications current. Open Settings, scroll down and tap on General. After that, tap Background App Refresh. Ensure Background App Refresh is set to Wi-Fi and cellular data. Solution 4. Check Date and Time Settings. Incorrect date and time settings can cause notification issues, so let's check that. Open Settings, then scroll down and tap on General. Next, scroll down again and tap Date and Time. Make sure Set Automatically is toggled on so your iPhone uses the correct time zone. Solution 5. Reset all settings. If notifications still aren't working, resetting all settings can often fix the problem. Here's how. Open settings, scroll down and tap general. Then tap transfer or reset iPhone. Tap reset and select all settings. Enter your passcode if prompted and confirm your choice. Note, this will reset system settings including Wi-Fi passwords and wallpapers, but it won't delete your data. By following these steps, you should be able to get FaceTime and IMS notifications working properly on your iPhone. Thanks for watching. If you found this guide helpful, make sure to hit that subscribe button for more troubleshooting tips. Stay tuned for the next video and happy troubleshooting.